Hey y'all, I'm going to show you how to make clarified butter or ghee. This thing at the grocery store costs about $15 for 13 ounces, but I'm going to show you how to make it for $5 using butter that you already have on hand. Here's what I'm starting with. I actually had this butter on hand, which is Lando Lakes Extra Creamy European Style Butter. It's a higher fat content, which is better for making clarified butter. But if you only have the regular kind or store brand, it's okay. You just won't get as much clarified butter in the end. I only have two sticks of this, so I'm gonna add in two more sticks so I can have a full pound of butter. You can actually see like a slight color difference in the two. This is the European style butter and this is the regular butter. As soon as all of your butter is melted, you can start skimming off all of this white foam that's on the inside. That's the stuff that you don't want. What you do want is all that clear butter. Make sure your heat is on medium low. You do not want brown butter. You want clarified butter. So if you see it starting to turn brown, you wanna take it off the heat immediately and you kinda of have to start over. I'm running my ladle just on the top so all I'm getting is that foamy stuff. Once you've skimmed off all of the white solids, you're basically done. We are going to strain this in a wire strainer just to make sure all of the milk solids are out. If you have cheesecloth on hand, go ahead and line it too, it's just for an extra preventative caution. If you don't have the cheesecloth, it's totally fine. And then pour your butter through the strainer all of the extra milk fat will be in the cheesecloth and in the strainer and then you are left with beautiful clarified butter look at this it took seven minutes about five dollars which is way better than 15 and it's homemade and something fun to do that you can say you did yourself and it lasts a really long time i um prefer to keep my homemade clarified butter in the fridge it will last for a month at least. If you are watching this on YouTube, I will put the recipe in the description. I'll see y'all next time.